My name is Mark Darrow. I'm a medical doctor. What you are about to see are procedures of PRP, platelet-rich plasma. The platelets contain growth factors and will stimulate the immune system to bring cells to the area that will actually grow back new tissue, stabilize the area, and eliminate pain. Much like prolotherapy, PRP can be used anywhere in the ligaments, tendons, muscles, joints, really anywhere from the top of the head to the bottom of the foot. I use ultrasound guidance to ensure that the maximum number of platelets are delivered to the exact injured area. If you have questions about the video you're about to see, feel free to contact me at 1-800-REHAB-10 or contact me through my website at jointrehab.com. The medical assistant is withdrawing blood from the patient's arm. You can see the syringe that the blood is being withdrawn into. Here the blood is placed into the PRP kit and it is going to be centrifuged. The platelets will be spun down. The platelet pour solution is removed and a small portion of it is mixed with the platelets to create a platelet rich plasma solution. This first injection is made with lidocaine so that the PRP will be a painless procedure. This bright image on the ultrasound is the femur bone. Above it is the fat pad and above that is the patellar tendon. In between is the capsule where the PRP will be injected and will be delivered to the entire knee joint. Here you can see the needle being introduced into the capsule and the solution being deposited. This patient is a 64 year old male who's had 45 years of knee pain. He was told that he needed a knee replacement after having several surgeries. He is an excellent candidate for PRP in order to stimulate new cartilage growth on his femur and tibia and hopefully avoid a total knee replacement.